and 17 News is your local election headquarters. Today marks the recall election of Governor Gavin Newsom with polls opening in just a matter of hours. 17's Moses Small joins us from the county elections office this morning with the latest. Moses? Alex, good morning. A ferocious campaign trail ends today as the fate of the state's highest office hangs in the balance. So here's a look at what you need to know before you hit the polls. Elections officials say over 170 polling sites will open around the county today for the state's recall election. Polls open at 7 this morning, so it's time to figure out when you're going to cast your ballot. Experts say thinking ahead can help you avoid long waiting times. Well, it's usually busy uh, early in the morning, people going in to vote before they go into work, and then late afternoon, usually again, uh, you know, on their way home from work. Yeah, oftentimes, again, if they're doing it outside of those busy, you know, peak times, I mean, they, sh they can just walk in and, and vote. There, there really wouldn't be a wait time. Every registered voter in the county should have received a ballot in the mail. You can bring that ballot to the polls. You can also register at any polling site today with a conditional voter registration form. Just come in, they fill out uh, what is essentially the information for, from the voter registration form. Now on election day itself, people can go to any poll site and then the poll workers would be able to, to do a conditional voter registration for them. A recent poll from UC Berkeley shows Governor Gavin Newsom is likely to come out on top, with about 60% of Californians reporting they'll vote to keep Newsom in office. But the results of this race won't be clear for hours or even days after polls close at 8 tonight. The vast majority generally in, in Kern County does come in as vote by mail. They do take longer to process, obviously, as we have to check the signatures and everything else. So um, that's why the results take, uh, you yeah, quite a while after election day. The county will release a first look at vote by mail tallies after the last voter in Kern has cast their ballot, which will likely be around nine tonight. Typically, you know, we would probably not be getting Ridgecrest in until about one in the morning or one thirty even. The latest county stats say voters are clamoring to make their votes count. About a quarter of Kern's registered voters sent in early mail-in ballots, with over 100,000 received so far. For a special election, that, that is a, a pretty high turnout, more than we you know, might, might have expected. If you want to find the polling site closest to you, just head to kernvote.com. And we'll have hour-by-hour -hour updates coming tonight on TV17. At the Kern County Elections Office, Moses Small, 17 News.